Hey everybody, this is Jen from Scan and Cut Jam Sessions and Scan and Cut Canvas and Scal Help on Facebook. I had someone ask about bringing a whole bunch of uh, SVG files at once over into a Scal. So what I did is I came here to my Facebook and um, or my yeah my uh, files library, and I have mine set up like this. Okay, so I came here and I found my SVG. So what I did is I clicked on this. Okay, I right clicked, brought up the right click file, or file options, send to, and I clicked on my document. So that'll send it to my documents. Okay, so let's come out here. Okay, so I have my, um, I have brought it out here. So then you drag and you drop it to Craft Edge. Okay. So I drug it and I dropped it to Craft Edge. Okay. So then it was in here. Okay. So let's just pretend it's floating in here. Well, I thought now, where do I want to put this in here so that it's going to show up? So I went here. And I found my library here. Well, I went to my projects and I thought, well, let's try to put it in here. So I put it in here. Okay. And when you put it in here, it doesn't work. It doesn't bring it up. So it didn't matter where I stuck it. It didn't work. So I came out here to my shapes. So I thought, well, let's bring it up here into our library. Okay, so there it is. Oops. Of course, now it doesn't want to work. Okay, so here's all of my stuff that I have in my little SVG folder. So what I did is I drug it and I put it into, let me come out here. I drugged it and I put it into my designs. Right here it is. Okay, so there's all of my SVGs. So that is how you go about bringing um, a big folder that you want. Um, so what you can do is you can um, create a folder um, in your documents Alright, that's the best way to do it. So you can come here, you can create a new folder. Um, anywhere, so you can create one. You can put SVG file or whatever, files one or however, you know, you want to do it. And you can pull all of the files that you want to take into Craft Edge. You can pull them and stick them all in this file. All right. So I can come into Facebook. Let's say I come into Facebook. If I want to send whatever, you know, SVGs, I can, let's say I come in here. Um, I want to send this one out. So what I want to do is I right click that brings this up and you click and you want to send it to your document click out of it and there it is so you'll drag so I'm left clicking and holding and dragging and you see it says move to SVG files okay so you'll put that all in your new folder here all right, so that will all go into your new folder. So go ahead and do that with all of your new SVGs that you want. And when you're done, you're going to bring this new folder over to Craft Edge. Drop it. You're going to come to Craft Edge. Find your new folder with your SVGs in it. You're going to click on that, you're going to drag it, and you're going to drop it into My Designs. 
Okay, you're going to click on that. You're going to open it up. Alright, so there it is. Let's come over here. Alright, so let's refresh this. Let it load. Okay, and there it is. All right. Because that's the new folder. So that's how you do it. Alright. So then you can go through and rename them whatever you want to do. I'm going to delete that. And we'll go through and clean all that up. But that's how you go about adding entire file folders into your SCAL libraries. Alright. If you guys have any questions, you can come find me over at Scan and Cut Canvas and Scale Help on Facebook. Thanks a lot, guys.